In this clip, we're going to look at some special notation used in Venn diagrams. The first bit of notation looks like this. When you see this symbol here, which looks a little bit like a lowercase n, it means the intersection of A and B. So on the Venn diagram, I would shade in this section here if I was asked to shade the part that represented this. The next special piece of notation is this and it looks a little bit like a lowercase u. This means the union of A and B. So that's everything in A and everything in B as well. So I need to shade in everything in A and B. The final bit of notation is this. Now this means the complement of A, but you might like to think of it as meaning not A. So shading this on the diagram would look like this. You'll see that I've shaded everything that's outside of the A circle. So to summarise, this means the intersection, that's this part. This means the union, that's everything in A and B. And this means the complement of A, or not A. So that's everything outside of A. Here are some for you to try now. You'll need to copy the Venn diagram three times and then shade the appropriate parts. Press pause and have a go. When you're ready, press play. So for A, we want the complement of A, that's everything that's not in A, united with everything that is in B. So everything that's not in A is this, and I need to include everything that's in B as well. So we also need to shade in this part, and this is the finished answer. For part B, we want the complement of A union B. So this is everything that's outside of A and B. So that's this. For C, we want the complement of A intersect B. So that's everything that's outside the intersection of A and B. So this is the answer for that one.